After watching this movie, you will believe an elephant can fly. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 Dumbo moments. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. For this list, we're taking a look at the most iconic scenes from Disney's 1941 animated classic. We're issuing a spoiler alert for those of you who haven't seen the film, but honestly, who hasn't? It ain't nobody's fault you got them big ears. Number 10. Casey Jr. Gets Going As the traveling circus prepares to hit the road, a cavalcade of animals is loaded onto Casey Jr., a steam locomotive that gets its name from American Railroad engineer Casey Jones. The train is able to accommodate a wide variety of animals, although the elephant matriarch needs an extra push to squeeze in. Although his screen time and facial expressions are limited, this sentient train still stands out as one of the most memorable parts of Dumbo. All aboard! Let's go! This can largely be attributed to the character's inventive design and catchy theme song, not to mention his can-do attitude. Speaking of which, Casey Jr. also pays homage to the little engine that could as he puffs his way up and down a hill. We knew he could. Number 9. Dumbo the Clown Excommunicated by his fellow elephants, Dumbo is forced to seek refuge with the clowns and is made the centerpiece in a burning building stunt. This scene calls some of the best classic cartoons to mind, as the clowns use watering cans and gasoline tanks to extinguish a fire, which literally backfires. As humorous as the sequence is, it's also nothing short of heartbreaking watching Dumbo land in a pool of pie filling, becoming a punchline for the amusement of others. <laughs> Despite Timothy's optimistic encouragement, Dumbo sees that there's no glory in being the butt of the joke, leaving both him and the audience in tears. Some clowns are intended to make us laugh, and others are meant to make us cry. But this scene does both. See? They're drinking a toast here. Number 8. The Magic Feather Use the magic feather! Catch you? The magic feather? Yeah, I got you. Dumbo! Look! The crows from Dumbo have become a subject of controversy in recent years, with some writers criticizing them as racist portrayals. That being said, they still play a crucial role in the film, singing the iconic song When I See an Elephant Fly, and most importantly giving Dumbo the magic feather. While really just an ordinary feather, it gives Dumbo the confidence he needs to flap his giant ears and fly off the ground. The magic feather! Now you can fly! They might have started off doubting Dumbo, but the crows ultimately help the little elephant to realize what he's truly capable of. The scene also demonstrates how sometimes simply believing in yourself is the first step towards accomplishing the seemingly impossible. Look! Hot diggity! You're flying! Number 7. Timothy Meets Dumbo Hey, Dumbo! Hey, come out now! Golly, maybe I scared him too. Folklore has led many to believe that elephants possess an irrational fear of mice. Dumbo flips this stereotype on its head, as Dumbo finds an unlikely friend in Timothy Q. Mouse. When Mrs. Jumbo is taken away, Timothy is the only one who sees that there's more to Dumbo than meets the eye. Look, Dumbo, I'm your friend. Although Dumbo never talks, his body language speaks volumes when Timothy attempts to earn his trust with a peanut and a promise to help free his mom. Dumbo eventually comes to view Timothy as a mentor. Timothy shows us the importance of looking out for the little guy, even when you yourself are an even littler guy. Dumbo the Great! Number 6. The Pyramid Stunt Aren't we a bit clumsy? Thanks to Timothy's influence, the circus ringmaster decides to make Dumbo the climax of an ambitious stunt. As the elephant matriarch maintains balance on a ball, several others climb on top of her to form a pyramid. Dumbo is supposed to spring himself to the peak of this pyramid and wave a flag, although his floppy ears make this easier said than done. Tripping his way in, Dumbo accidentally rams into the ball and anarchy erupts. 
the size of the elephants only contributes to the scale of the slapstick, leaving us on pins and needles as the towering animals are sent skyrocketing through the air. As the tent collapses, Dumbo hits one of his lowest moments with his confidence shattered and his flag broken. Number 5. Mrs. Jumbo is taken away. Isn't that the funniest thing you ever saw? Dumbo is initially drawn to several obnoxious kids who visit the Big Top, too innocent to realize that they're making fun of his ears. Mrs. Jumbo tries to shield her baby from the ridicule, but an especially bratty boy pulls Dumbo out from under her. As her animal and parental instincts kick in, Mrs. Jumbo gives the little punk a much-deserved spanking. The circus fails to recognize the clear animal cruelty at play, however, restraining Mrs. Jumbo and chaining her in a wagon. With his mother deemed a mad elephant, Dumbo is left alone to cry himself to sleep. While it's not quite as devastating as the death of Bambi's mom, seeing Mrs. Jumbo and Dumbo torn apart is guaranteed to rip anyone's heart out. Number 4. Dumbo's Delivery Here is a baby with eyes of blue, straight from heaven, right to you. Storks delivering babies is a fable we're all familiar with, and the opening of Dumbo is one of the most popular examples. Look out for Mr. Stork sees several circus animals receive offspring from the white birds. Although it appears Mrs. Jumbo has been overlooked at first, she soon paid a visit from a stork voiced by Winnie the Pooh himself, Sterling Holloway. Sign here, please. The stork caps off the delivery with a birthday song, leaving Mrs. Jumbo to finally open her package. Although the baby elephant inside couldn't be cuter, he's quickly deemed an outcast for having large ears and earns the nickname of Dumbo. Mrs. Jumbo doesn't care what the others think, though, slamming the door on their trunks and tending to her little one. Number 3. Pink Elephants on Parade Pink Elephants on Parade is definitely among the most surreal moments in any Disney film, which is exactly what makes it so enduring. As strange as it sounds, the scene begins with Dumbo and Timothy accidentally getting drunk. The insanity is just beginning, as the bubbles materialize into literal pink elephants. Tooting their trunks like trumpets, the elephants form a manic marching band. The trippy imagery is perfectly paired with the song Pink Elephants on Parade, amounting to a sequence that's chaotic, colorful, and just a little creepy. While this musical number admittedly doesn't add much to the plot, it showcases some of the most creative animation to come out of Disney's golden age, sticking with us like a crazy dream. Number 2. Baby Mine Dumbo has no shortage of tear-jerking moments, but we can all agree that the Baby Mine segment ignites the most waterworks. After being separated, Dumbo is given a chance to visit his caged mother, if only for a little while. What makes this scene especially gut-wrenching is that Mrs. Jumbo can barely reach Dumbo, only able to extend her trunk out to him. Nevertheless, the two make the most out of the time they have together, with Mrs. Jumbo cradling Dumbo to a bittersweet lullaby. Alas, this comforting moment can't last forever, and the two must eventually part ways. If Dumbo waving his trunk goodbye doesn't give you the feels, you're probably made of stone. Number 1. Dumbo Flies at the Circus Dumbo, you're standing on the threshold of success! Don't look down, it'll make you dizzy. As sad as Dumbo can get, the film thankfully builds to a climax that can only be described as uplifting. Shortly after his previous flight, Dumbo prepares to show off his talents to the rest of the world. As Dumbo plunges down, however, he loses his grip on the magic feather, leaving his fate up in the air. It takes some extra reassurance from Timothy, but Dumbo takes off like an airplane just in the nick of time. Upstaging the clowns and other elephants, Dumbo emerges as the circus's new star attraction. We did it! Let's show up, Dumbo! Power die! Having overcome all the odds, it only makes sense to close Dumbo's story on the highest note possible, but not before the titular character shares a tender reunion with his recently freed mother. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.